arg c and arg v. There are two arguments your main function takes, but what are they and what are they used for? arg c stands for argument count, and arg v stands for argument vector. arg c, as the name implies, keeps a count of your arguments, while arg v is an array of strings. If you don't pass any arguments to your program, arg c will still have the value of 1. This implies that we should have a single argument passed to arg v. So let's write a simple program that will check what that argument is. So as you can see, we printed out the name of our program. This is because when you run your program, the first argument arg v will be populated by is the name of your program. But what if we want to pass in a few values of our own? How would we do that? First, let's update our program to handle more values. And now from the command line, we can run our program as we did before, but now what we're going to do is going to append arguments that will be read by our program. So for example, if I run a.out, and I can append, let's say, hello and world as the two arguments. As you can see, our program read the two arguments, hello and world, and printed them back to us. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you check out the playlist on your screen right now, and I will see you later.